Hey guys, Alterstate here. Welcome back to Sekiro Shadows Die Twice. Uh, so I apologize for the last episode. Um, it was really... My audio was really quiet, and I didn't know exactly what was going on. Turns out I plugged my microphone into the wrong USB slot on my computer, and uh, apparently that makes a difference. So I have fixed it. I'm sorry for... I'm sorry. I mean, you know, I just can't help myself sometimes. Oops, I bet that was worth a lot of money. Um, yeah, so we... Uh, last time, it was, there wasn't a whole lot going on, so the commentary, I guess, didn't matter too much. Uh, it was mostly just talking to NPCs and... Wolf, found something. I've opened the library. Meet me there. Oh, okay. Uh, it was mostly just talking to NPCs, drinking sake, and just uh, hanging out. So, The burner smells faintly of Sakura flowers. So we got to go find that flower in the reservoir, maybe? Let's go back to... Oops, no. Let's go back to the temple and see if... See if something happens now. Kept, kept alluding to the temple. Or maybe we need to find that flower or something first, but I don't know. I don't know. I don't know exactly where to go. The, he kind of told us a whole bunch of different ways to go. Said through the woods. I got a key for something. Um, maybe go check out that reservoir area. Well, the guy's gone. Something happen over here now? Inspect. Whoa. Uh. Oh, a new belt to ring. <gasps> Is this one gonna transport us to a memory too? I like how we can use that prosthetic just like any old normal hand. <laughs> Adventure time. Uh, the snow is going up. Whoa, where are we? There's monkeys wearing clothes. Look at them. Three monkeys. Flavor Flav. One of the panels is empty. Uh oh. There he is. He's got glasses. <laughs> Hi. Oh, he's got a purple butt. Elusive Hall Bell, a five-pronged bell made of aged bronze, can be used repeatedly. When rung, monkeys and wolves alike are returned to their initial states. Huh, a monkey caught in the folding screen will not escape, whether the bell is rung or not. W wait, what? However, a monkey caught in the folding screen will not escape whether the bell is rung or not. What does that mean? Folding screen monkeys? Is this a boss fight? Should I equip the bell? Um, I got the bell. Hello? Whoa! Careful now. What the hell? Oh, hello. Um. Wait, wait, wait. What did that do? I'm so confused. Hi, can you help me? Yet another who is lost. Yeah. I believe you are on a mission. 
and wish to leave this place. Yes. Then you must defeat the monkeys depicted on the panels at the hall entrance. Once you have done so, the divine child's voice will reach you. Um, well, there's the green one right there. The monkey in the green kimono is the hearing monkey. He has excellent hearing, can hear across great distances. Very so you got to be he quiet. Will generally run away the moment he hears you coming, making it hard to approach. He is exceedingly timid. Okay, what about the, the orange one. In the orange tomorrow is the speaking monkey. While he does not have particularly good eyesight or hearing, he makes a big fuss when he sees a threat, causing all the other monkeys to run. Oh, perhaps he merely enjoys toying with humans. Okay. The monkey in the purple kimono is the seeing monkey. He has excellent eyesight, can see great distances, and is very attentive. If he spots you, he will run immediately. He is exceedingly timid. Okay, so... I do not wish to leave. All right, it is you stay here. Quiet here, which means it is near to Nirvana in its own way. At least that is how it feels to me. Oh yes. By the way, there was once someone who, like you, was on a mission. I believe he chased the monkeys for a while, but everything here eventually went silent. Mm. I pray that you succeed. Okay, so we gotta, like, we gotta stealth kill these monkeys. There's a green one. He kind of saw me. The noise of the roaring waterfall is definitely ensuring no one can hear anything else in here. Okay, the green one's on the tree. I think the orange one's above me. I don't know where the purple one is. Okay. Killed the green monkey. Oh. Is that the purple one? Or is that not the real purple one? Am I terrified? Is that monkey terrifying? There's the purple one. Don't you... What? Who is banging? Now it's noisy in here. A bare flame in the wind. When it goes out, the place becomes dark as night. Ah. It sounds like he's above me still. This is, this is really interesting, I gotta say. Just hear the sounds of monkeys running around everywhere. Which 
Should I go over and try and find the orange kimono monkey? It's a little pitter-patter. Where? Is that the... Okay, I see a monkey. Shouldn't... Okay, how do I sneak up on this monkey of a meow? What does this one say? This bell is deafening. Ringing it recklessly will also make your ears ring. Come back here, you bitch! Okay, got the purple one. Now I gotta find the orange one. And I'm guessing there's a fourth one that it doesn't doesn't tell me about. Oh. God, it just sounds like there's monkeys all around me. <laughs> Terrifying monkeys. Bad monkey. Okay. The orange one was the first one I saw. Where did he go? This is, uh, I don't understand. Is there a note in here to read? Can you tell me something about, about this? Hmm. That's the bell. I rang the bell. So I'm pretty sure the orange one was over there. Yeah, there he is. Better get back up there. Okay, he can't see very well and he can't hear very well. I gotta... Did he run? Which way did he run? Going this way? Ow! Oh, oh my god! Hold on. Hold on, hold on. 
almost terrified. Uh, what is what is that thing called? Pacifying agent. Bad monkey. Okay, there's one monkey left. But where is he? Is he up here? I'm gonna go ahead and heal just because. Like, it's. Sounds like he's all around me. Ghost monkey! Folding screen monkeys. Caught the folding screen monkeys. Sweet. And that was a boss fight, and it was easy. I mean, it was long, and it was kind of stressful a little bit, but, uh, yeah. Please, forgive them. Oh, there's the ghost monkey now, and they're all facing they away. thought to keep me hidden. Show yourself a little bit. Seems it was not meant to be. Oh boy. No wonder it's No wonder it sounded like there was a monkey around me the whole time. Let us meet at the there was. Okay, that's the voice of the divine child. Are we at the inner sanctum now? Whoa. Hmm. Hey, memories, green monkeys. Bad memory extra. Okay, commune with the. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The following. Folding screen monkeys guarded the Hall of Illusions and befriended the Divine Child of Rejuvenation. Choir skills, puppeteer, ninjutsu. Oh, I haven't even equipped the other one to try that one. Ninjutsu technique that manipulates the victim like a puppet. Costs spirit emblems to use. Activate after backstab death blow. This technique temporarily forces one who should have fled this realm to remain. <coughs> puppet moves on behalf of its master, but its strings are destined to snap. Whoa. Uh. Let's look around here a little bit. See if there's any carp, and then we'll go commune with the divine child. Or any any lotus flowers or anything like that. Pellet. Feeling this is not where we're supposed to go, but I just wanted to look. Oh, there's a statue. There's two statues. Oh wait, is this back in the temple? Uh, let's not go that way yet. It might be back in the temple. There was a door that didn't open from this side in the temple. So that might, uh, very well might be. Oh, I see the divine. It's a hand's attack power again. Yay, halls of illusion lie on the threshold betwixt life and death. Departed souls of the divine children drift and sway, taking shelter in the monkeys of the temple, such as the way of the divine child of rejuvenation speaks of them as friends. Sweet. We have more attack power. Hello? Why do you seek this place? And I seek I the mortal blade. Do you know of the blade that cannot be drawn? Yes. It is so called, for not one who has drawn it has ever survived. Yet you still wish to attempt this. I do. I do. I see. Very well. 
Mm. Well, if you are prepared, does it replace my normal sword or is it a prosthetic? You may gaze upon the blade. Does she speak without moving her lips? Is she like a Dark Souls character? Whoa, demony. Just come back. How are you? I got that blood. Your eye. My eye. I see. You carry the curse of the dragon's heritage. The mortal blade. Without question. I accept its power. Cool. Mortal Blade, an Odachi capable of slaying the undying. Its crimson blade will take the life of any who dares draw it. Without the power of resurrection, one could not hope to wield this blade, which allows one to defeat even infested beings. Long concealed within Senpu Temple, the blade is inscribed with its true name, Gracious Gift of Tears. Sweet. Now what? I see you serve the divine heir of the dragon's heritage. Yes. Why do you seek the mortal blade? I wish to obtain the dragon tears from the divine realm to sever the ties of immortality. I see. I have read about this. Mm. I have read there is a way to sever the dragon's heritage. Mm. <clears throat> Which means the divine heir begrudges the power of the dragon's heritage. That's right. Sense. How strange fate can be. I am one of the children of the rejuvenating waters. Created by those who would stop at nothing to achieve immortality. My false dragon's blood was created by man. Children? So there are many of you. I am the only one who survived the process. The others are laid to rest here. Oh, I man. I do not know if it is right to sever the ties of immortality, but the dragon's heritage undeniably corrupts the lives of men. And I share the heir's feelings about that truth. Shinobi of the Divine Heir, I have decided to assist you. Thanks. Please, hold out your hand. What? Bless us with bountiful harvest. Uh, rice. Oh... Rice that spilled from the palms of the child of rejuvenation gradually recovers vitality for a time. Even in falsehood, the power of the dragon's blood brings a bountiful harvest. Rice is precious. The flavor grows richer with each bite and is sure to raise one's spirit. This is... rice? There you are. Rice is a precious thing. It tastes better the more you eat it and restores one's vigor. Hmm. And that one lady was asking for rice from the divine child. Shinobi of the Divine Air, you are welcome here. Request rice? Oh. What about this? This is for you. What is this? <coughs> I was told to give this to you. Thank you. I will accept it. <laughs> What's wrong? I, I still cannot help but detest them. What did that do? I apologize. The rice is not yet ready for har- I shall give you more when the harvest- Okay. Farewell, Shinobi of the Divine Air. May the harvest be plentiful wherever your path may lead. Okay. Well, I know someone that, that wants some of that ri- Oopsies. Sorry. I bet- Nope. That was disrespectful. <laughs> um. I know someone that wants that rice. Maybe we'll go make our way to her. Next time. I should also equip one of my ninjutsu things because I got those and I never actually equip one. Six spirit emblems. Turns the blood into smoke screen. Manipulates the victim like a puppet. Temporarily forces one who should have fled this realm to remain. Puppet moves on behalf of its master, but its strings are destined to snap. 
Let's try the puppet ninjutsu. Okay, um, I guess we'll take a break here and... Well, first I, I do want to go up here and see if this is, does lead back to the temple. It looks like it looks like it does. But it's a pretty... Um, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, yeah. Yeah, yeah, see? Does this... And I can still go back to the monkey realm? I don't think I need to go back there, but... I can, now. Okay, well, yeah, we're gonna take a break here, and then we'll figure out where to go next. Maybe I'll go back to talk to Akuro real quick. Just let him know I've found the mortal blade. Which, oh, I've got it on my back, and I've got my sword. How do I use it? I don't know. Um... Mortal draw. Combat art using the mortal blade. Cost spirit emblems to use. Flash of a sword. The blade slashes through enemies, leaving a reddish black noxious mist. The seeping mist extends the range of the blade. A technique used the blade cannot be drawn is feat only the oath bound of the divine air could achieve. Okay, so I can draw it by using the thing and then I just attack with it. Cut through enemies with the extended range sword attacks. Okay, I wonder if that'll help me defeat the headless enemy. Maybe we'll try that soon too. So, uh, got a lot of a lot of things to go check out. So, but for now we're gonna take a break. So, thank you guys for watching. Like this video, comment on it, and subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos like it. Follow me on Twitter at alterds underscore tweets, and I will see y'all next time. Bye.